Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on this look. This look was very, very, very highly requested by a lot of people. Surprisingly, because nobody likes watching my videos. But anyways, I just did a tutorial on this look, and let's just get started because I'm super excited. So to start the face, I'm taking my MAC Fix Plus, and I'm spritzing this all over my face to prime. And then I'm just trying to like dry that off so it becomes a little bit more tacky. Then I'm taking my foundation, and this is a mineral one from MAC. I'm putting this all over my face, and I'm blending it in with my buffing brush from Real Techniques. And I also want to apologize for sounding like a horse. I am sick. So I'm taking my Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer, which is probably the worst concealer I've ever used, but I used it just for this tutorial. Uh, I'm using that to highlight under my eye and hopefully conceal a little bit. I'm also using it on my chin and my forehead as well. Then I'm taking my Smooth Skin Loose Face Powder from New York Color, which is actually really good, and I'm using it all over my like entire face. I was too lazy to use a face powder, so I just used this. And of course I dropped my brush again. So I'm taking my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer and I'm trying to like bronze up my face a little bit. I've mentioned this in a video before, but this bronzer is way too dark for me. So I'm kind of just using this one in the meantime before I get another one. Uh, I didn't want to contour so I just did this. So now I'm moving on to the eyes. I'm taking my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion and I'm putting this all over my eyes to prime my eyelids, of course. So while that's setting, I'm using my glow kit, and this is in Gleam, and I'm using a stippling brush to apply this. I find this works like a little bit better, and I'm using a mixture of all the colors besides Mimosa, just because it's a bit brown and I don't want to use that one. Then I'm using my chocolate bar palette. I'm taking like a deep brown, applying this into the crease. I'm doing it kind of like a V shape and then I'm blending it out and I'm using a lighter shade to bl help blend it out. I'm going to leave the shade names on the screen just so you can see them. So I'm using another color to blend that out and it just makes it look a lot, lot prettier. Then I'm taking the same dark color I used from before and I'm putting that into the crease just to intensify it. And then I just blended it again with a different color, just so it would be a little more, more, more nice. And then I applied the white color, which I actually know is called white chocolate, and I applied that to my ooh, ball of my eye and then on my brow bone. I just want a little highlight, and then I did my brows. I've never done my brows like this before, and I'm very glad that I never do because the brows in this video look like absolute shit. <laughs> I will never do my brows like this again. I just wanted to do like a little bit more, but they look like a toe, so let's just not even do that. So now I'm just doing some liquid liner to prep for my fake lashes. And of course, you know I'm using the Art Dowel Demi Wispy Lashes just because these are my favorite and they look really nice. And it was very, very hard to stay in focus just because I was looking at my little mirror, which by the way is awesome. Thank you, mom and dad, for a very, very nice birthday gift. <coughs> So then I'm taking the same light brown color and I'm putting that on my lower lash line and then I'm taking a darker color just to like make it look a lot nicer. Then I'm using mascara just to plump up my lashes, mixing my natural and the fake ones together. And then I'm taking my NYX Liquid Suede Liquid Lipstick and this is in Soft Spoken and I'm using this for my lips. Before, when I took the picture on Instagram, I used Whirl by MAC, but I thought this was like a good substitute, so you could use either one. And then that is the entire look. I hope you guys enjoy. So thank you guys for 
for watching this video. I'm not gonna tell you to subscribe because you can do whatever the fuck you want. But I just hope you guys enjoyed this video. Even if you didn't, I enjoyed making it. So I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you in my next video.